took you so long. I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! We can get up through there! Get easy. Drink this. It'll help. You could have left me in that river. Would you have left me? I'd have thought about it. <laughs> what makes you think I didn't? What makes you risk so much to come here? The Divine Source. I know what you're looking for. But I want to know why. When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist, too. In his last years, he was... obsessed with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him, including me. Our last conversation was a fight he... He took his own life. 
I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the Divine Source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing. No. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't. Or won't. I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon. Jacob, are you there? Damn it. Where is he? contact with the native in the old sawmill. We've wounded her, but it looks like they set traps around the perimeter. I've got one casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Alone again. Jacob's gone ahead. There's something about him that I can't quite put my finger on. Strange, but almost comforting. Like I could tell him anything, and it wouldn't faze him. I sense no judgment from him. Yet, at the same time, he's hard to read. My instincts tell me he's a good man. He saved my life. I think I can trust him. At least, for now. But I can't shake a nagging feeling that he knows more than he's letting on.
Don't shoot. I'm with Jacob. He told us to wait for you, but these bastards found us first. Oh, God. Are you all right? I'll live. But I need a safe place to rest, in case the invaders return. There's a cave across the bridge over there. A wolf den. They won't look there, but I can't clear it out on my own. Not like this. If you could kill them, we'll have a safe place to regroup. I might even have something for that pistol of yours. Can you help us? Yes, of course. Stay out of sight. I'll be back. Thank you. Jacob was right about you. back. Good. You can help us then. What's the problem? I have warriors spread across this valley. Last night, two of my bravest were captured, and I have reason to believe they are still alive. There was a third with them who escaped, and he tells me they were taken beneath the train station. Saw them put into cages before he managed to escape. I have a dozen other warriors in the valley, and I have to stay here to coordinate their strikes. But you, I've seen what you can do. And I must ask you to help. Yes. Yes, of course. Thank you. They knew the risks, and they would happily die for the cause. But I can't let that happen.
If there's someone in here, it's safe. You can come out now. Maybe one of these lockers. They must still be hiding in here. 